And I have no idea what this is. It's a... Uh, from China at least. Uh, I guess they bought two electronic modules. Now I know how to open the box. I think I bought a pair. Let me go zoom in a little bit. A pair of electronic loads. I don't have the specification sheet down here with me. And I don't know if they can be independently powered. 25 watt electronic load. Current control. On off switch. Based on the same frame and and front panel dimensions as the many many power supplies I've used. Oh, I guess it comes apart. These actually may be from AliExpress. I think these things are eight to twelve dollars on AliExpress. They're not at all on Banggood, and there's a, a couple of them on eBay that are like uh, twenty-five dollars. I thought I could take a look at this a little electronic load. Now, it's an XY FZ25. It was sold as a 35 watt electronic load, and the uh, discharge power is listed as 35 watts. I'm not sure why it's called an why well, this one is called an FC-25 when this one is called an FC-35 so I'm not sure just what we're doing here so I've supplied it here from a 12 volt supply and I'll turn it on I don't know what that means. This lead is coming from a 10 volt 30 amp power supply. So I mean it will, with the exception of lead loss, be very stable. And when I say 10 volts, it's an analog meter supply and I'm looking at the meter from an angle. I'll power it up now. So it says 10.13 volts. And I'll turn the load on.
and it's at zero amps. Oh, there we go. So let's take it up to 10 watts, which would be one amp at 10 volts. Meanwhile, I'll take a look at the fine adjustment on my power supply. Adjust it to 10 volts at 1 amps. This is 10 watts. The fan has begun to spin. And so I, I don't feel good sitting on, up on the fan. <laughs> but this is dissipating 10 watts. Well, that shouldn't even come close to 25 watts. Let's take it up to... Uh, two amps or uh, 20 watts two amps now I, I would imagine I have some lead loss here so I'm going to fine adjust my power supply again to bring it up to 10 volts So now we're dissipating here 20 watts. I'll take the bench meter. It says 10.014 volts. The analog power supply meter says around 2 amps. So I'm going to leave this thing sit. for about 20 minutes. So it's been 20 minutes at 20 watts. Now according to whatever documentation this is, this has over voltage protection, over power protection, over temperature protection. So let's run this thing up not knowing if it's a 25 watt or a 35 watt. Let's run it up to 30 watts. Well, here we go. Ah. Over power protection. Turn it off. Oh, that must have reset it. Okay. I'll bet when I get around two and a half amps, this thing shuts down. That is drawing two and a half amps. So this is a 25 watt electronic load. And it's shutting down an over power at 25 watts. I now turn down the voltage to five volts. So now I should be able to turn the current up to 5 amps. That would be 25 watts. Doesn't seem to have an acceleration control on it. Well, that's interesting. 
it won't go above 4.1 amps. I'll take it down to 4 exactly. So, if that were 5 volts, this would be 20 watts. I'll raise the voltage and we'll see when it shuts down. Shutting down on overpower. That apparently is the, sh the amp setting because it's not drawing any current right now. I guess it's flashing. If I try to turn it on, it goes into overpower protection. Turn the voltage down to say 6. Okay, that's actually drawing 4 amps at 5.8 volts. As I said, these are available from Ali. They don't seem to be available on Banggood or eBay. And I did order, I'll have to go back and do, look at my Ali buyer page. I have a couple more of these on order pending delivery. I'll see if the second order is a 35 watt unit. And this package came from China. <laughs> this package is from AliExpress, although uh, Matilda shipped it. And it's a, an FZ35 or two. FZ35. So it's a 35 watt load. And that's what this would have predicted. And you can see it's an FZ35. I'm probably going to, in the near future, show the templates and the, Kate and the mounting of probably two of them. For some reason, I always do two. In a case with some banana plugs and a power switch, whatever. And if the next ones I get are 35 watt, I'll, I'll use them. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, give me a thumbs up, please. Uh, subscribe to my site. Please come back for the next video. Thank you.